Hey bloggy pals, it's Tuesday and I'm Sophia. I've been on here like twice before, maybe three times. <laughs> if you remember me, great. If you don't, that's cool. That's fine. No hard feelings. No, actually maybe some hard feelings. How dare you. This week's theme is dream jobs. Um, and a lot of my dream jobs are actually very similar to Val and Justin's. Let's actually go in like chronological order to what I remember. When I was like five in kindergarten, I remember telling everybody that I wanted to be president and that I wanted to be the first female president. I feel like that's the thing with every child though, that they want to be president or be king or be princess. Um, then for a while I wanted to be a doctor because my parents are both doctors and I kind of thought I should do that and that I was obligated to do that. And then I realized that I am really, really, really averse to needles and the concept of things going into my body, like knives, or doing that to other people. I could not dissect a starfish in seventh grade. So that was very quickly mixed off the list. Then for a while I wanted to be an astronaut. I'm pretty sure my eyesight was too bad to be an astronaut and I'm like not in prime physical shape. But like, that's a cool job. I don't know what I would add to the field of astronauting, but it seems cool. You get to see the world from outer space. They have internet. Um, then for a while I wanted to be an author, and I still wanted to be an author when I first went into college, but then very recently my desire to write has just, you know, gone off a cliff, so that's kind of, it's on the back burner. Um, then I wanted to be a psychologist for a while. I wanted to help treat people who were, you know, depressed, anxious, had like different uh, psychological disorders. Um, fun fact, you should probably not be a psychologist or a psychiatrist if you are in, an incredibly introspective person. My first semester of psychology in college, I diagnosed myself with a myriad of different psychological disorders and now I want to go into business marketing and advertising. Pretty much go into like the social media field of that and kind of help revamp the advertising industry because it's incredibly misogynistic and it makes people... How do I explain it? The advertising industry is the business of making people feel inadequate so that they feel compelled to buy their product especially in the fashion advertising industry. It is pretty much targeted to make you feel bad so that you want to buy their clothes to feel good. Um, the technology advertising industry is different. Um, it's all kind of psychological manipulation, and I find that fascinating. Um, it's also just really interesting, and I think the social media aspect of it is really cool. So that's what I want to do, ideally. Um, oh! Also, get paid to sleep. That's something I've always wanted to do because who would not want to just get money to sleep? Still haven't found my job. Watching cartoons too. Um, like the, the, the beta testers for like games and cartoons and stuff. That's a cool job. I'm still very interested in that, but yeah. There are a lot of different jobs that I find really fascinating and that I would like to do, but definitely the more realistic one and the one I am gunning for right now is, you know, marketing and advertising. And hopefully within the next five to ten years, that's where I'll be. Who knows? Anyway, thank you Patrick for inviting me to sub in today. I love this channel and I love helping out in any way. And I can't wait to see the rest of your, the, the rest of your videos. Um, yeah, I'll see y'all later.